Hey guys, welcome back to the Game Replay. I'm Dave the Usher. The game we're playing is Final Fantasy X HD Remaster for the Sony PlayStation 3. Good stuff. Okay, so uh, I kind of wanted to get into the sphere grid just to show you what's going on. Uh, I actually moved the majority of uh, my fighters over here. Uh, we're actually at the end of Titus's uh, path. Uh, there is quick hit right here. And the reason why I did that is because, well, there were there were uh, a bunch of empty uh, nodes here that it's actually kind of confusing now uh, with so many names. But yeah, Orin is a little more highlighted. But anyway, yeah, empty nodes and this and that. So I put like strength spheres and all the, you know, accuracy spheres and the special ones all here. And, uh, you know, because we're nearing the end of things. I mean, I got to do something with the remainder of my time because... This game's gonna be done soon, so I thought, why don't we just link everyone over here, and I can, uh, learn a bunch of stuff here. Uh, yeah, I started everyone kind of near the end, and now I'm backtracking this way, as you can see. Uh, walk is a little further than the rest, but I can move Orin right here, and, uh, yeah, see, these are plus fours because they're the special ones. So, hey, why not, man? And you can move uh, a little more. I guess I can, uh, I can do all this now, I suppose. Oh, but for, uh, Yuna, yeah, that's Flare. We're basically at the end of where, uh, Lulu would be. Now I'm kind of moving back in the opposite way again. Yeah, you want to start from the end of someone else's, uh, sphere grid with a friend sphere or a teleport sphere or, you know, something like that. So you can get, like, you know, the better stat boosters. You know, you don't want to go to the beginning of someone's path because it'll be like plus ones, uh, plus twos. So, I mean, that's no fun. And since uh, I'm going to be ending things, you know, we might as well rack up as much as possible because... Actually, I haven't... Look at this. I have not taught... There we go! And that's kind of uh, an official end to Titus's... His path. <laughs> I just did it there. Oh yeah, you can see all the ones. Uh, those are the new ones that I added with uh, blank uh, sphere circles. Yeah. The blanks! So I guess I'll just move back with Titus now. Yeah, see, they're all like plus fours and this and that. <laughs> Walk is right here. Didn't get this one. Uh, Alright. And I guess I'm just moving back this way as well. Yeah, I think I used Waka to add uh, all of the uh, extra spheres, I think. Because he had the most moves. Uh, at least he did. But yeah, with Kamari, ah, oh, Kamari. You know, I always feel like, uh, I don't know. I wish he wasn't like a clone copier. And uh, like I said in the beginning, you know, I could have taken him uh, down a couple of different routes. I uh, chose to follow Waka's route. I mean, he's pretty close to being done himself. Uh, what's this? A sleep Buster, and then it's kind of wrapping it up over here. Yeah, and then there's the Triple Fountain. Not too far behind, but uh, I, I just feel like he'll always be a step behind the majority of other people. Riku, uh, oh, I'm starting her. Oh, I'm starting her over here too. I didn't. Oh, I thought it was Waka who I made the pathway with. No, it was Riku. I was like, you know what? Might as well put Riku with all the with all the Briz too. You know, let's get her more powerful. Why not? It's it's the end of the game. So yeah, it was Riku who I was using all of those uh, special spheres with, because uh, she had so many moves. Oh, look at that, an HP sphere. Uh, okay. I guess I'll put it there. I'm not gonna be able to. I don't think I'll be able to get anyone else over there. But, okay, what the hell. I can use another, too. Let's see. Oh, I have another HP... I have another HP sphere. I could use the Master Sphere. MP Sphere. Luck Sphere. And this and that. You know, I'm gonna use the other HP Sphere. I can always use the Teleport Spheres... If you want to do one quick little thing, I mean, that's uh, that's going pretty crazy. I mean, at this point, folks, it doesn't really matter, and I'm not too concerned about these uh, last few bosses. I think it's a little early to start celebrating. 
Man, we must have hit that thing enough by now. Pops Machina always seem to break when you need them most. Hey, you're telling me, kind of, kind of a bad time for uh, a breakdown. Fimshin, Nemo Nadim, you care? We're counting on you, kid. And he brings up the menu so we can pick a destination. If we were to go to Bavel right now, would would anything different happen? I very much doubt it if we went anywhere. I'm not going to do it because it's just such a distraction right now. I mean, we're, we're right in the middle of this, man. This is time for sin. This isn't time for anything else. Still... Still, it's kind of curious. If we went to Bavel, would Maroda and Passe be there? Would they say anything like, Oh yeah, so Sid just crashed into the side of Bavel right here. Okay, that's interesting. This isn't over. Not yet. Oh, I know it's not. Uh, we're going to be fighting Sin again, and the upcoming battle is pretty crazy. Uh, eventually, Sin uses a move, and it's kind of instant death and instant game over. And I can't recall if even auto life can save you from that move. I'm not sure it matters. I think we have to defeat Sin within uh, the time limit, even though there's not really a time limit. Sin still lives. Kimari knows. May I help you? Thank you. Your patronage is very much appreciated. So I'm not really concerned. Uh... I'll just whip out an Aeon. I'll kill Sin. I am not worried about it, man. Hopefully I can see his life. His life bar. You know, it always helps. It always helps knowing uh, how much life your opponent has. We will charge into Sin, no? Let us do great battle! The main gun is finished. It, I cannot repair. Alright, so we're gonna go check on Yuna, who's up on the uh, main deck. We're gonna go up on there and uh, see what our next move is gonna be. Good stuff. I wonder if Sir Jack He's in pain. Let's just end this. Quickly. The Faith said they'd help us, right? It bothers me, the way they said that. Huh? I mean, they've been fighting alongside us this whole time, but now they say they'll help? I guess so. Wait. Sin is reborn when Yu Yevon merges with an Aeon. Isn't that right? If I summon an Aeon, Yu Yevon will join with it. But at first, it'll be small, won't it? Yeah. Then we might be able to beat it without the final summoning. I don't know. What if Yu Yevon jumps again? Then we'll take it down again. We'll fight him until there's no place left to run. I never thought it would come down to this. Yeah, I know. Hey, the Faith, they're tired of this whole thing too. Let's let them rest. The Faith said it's pointless to keep dreaming. The dream will disappear, he said. What did he mean? And... What is it that Yu Yevon is summoning from within Sin? The dream of the faith. You won't go away, will you?
He's waiting for you. Well, son, the main gun is still busted. We can't give you any cover fire. Hey, just take us in. We'll do the rest. All right. Take us up, flush to the mouth! No mistakes, or I'm gonna tear out that mop you call hair! Uh, trust me. Me, take you there. Uh, no problem, yeah? Let's get ready to blitz! Let's go. Just you and me. Let's go, just you and me? Uh, Lulu, I don't think that's gonna work. I think we need everyone for this battle. It's kind of important. What is, what is she talking about? What is up with that? Well, the song did its job, so don't worry about it, man. You can talk to Sid again. All he'll say is, we're counting on you, kid. And then up comes the list. I'm still very curious if we go to the high bridge, if anything will happen. I don't think so. I don't, I don't think so. I believe that's all. So folks, uh, this is pretty much it. Make sure you're stocked up. Make sure you're ready to roll out. And I mean, yeah, you could use the map, go somewhere where there's battles and then uh, prepare your overdrives again for your characters and your Aeons, this and that. Uh, do anything you gotta do, you know, nothing wrong in being prepared, so yeah, if you need to, do it! We will charge into Sin, no? Let us do great battle! I see these guys say the same stuff. The main gun is finished. It I cannot repair. So yeah, folks, when you're all set, it's time to go up there. Yeah, this is kind of a, a timed battle without a timer. Uh, basically, we have to finish Sin off uh, in a bunch of turns, and after a bunch of turns go by, he's gonna use, like, a mega kill move, and uh, we're all dead. Everyone is dead. So, make sure you finish him off before that happens, okay? No problem. That's all you gotta do. Piece of cake. And that's what I'm gonna do right now. I'm just gonna use everyone in the battle, and uh, the best of the best move-wise, you know? Good stuff. for you, Dad. So yeah, Sin is gonna draw us to him uh, a bunch of times. We don't have any uh, commands, I think, in this battle. Uh, I'm, uh, I guess I'm gonna get everyone involved. We might as well do that. I'm gonna still save some of these overdrives for later. <laughs> Riku has Ultima as well. I suppose I'll use that. So yeah, this battle can be a doozy, and uh, keep an eye on Sin's gauge. I'm thinking we do not want that to fill up. That would be bad. And yeah, you can see his, uh, you can see his HP. Finish him before he opens his mouth all the way. Good stuff. Because then he'll eat you. Alive. Alright, so little Haystag, uh, we're going to be casting some uh, some Ultima. It's the way to go. Uh, Orin, uh, it's not the way to go. Not right now. Waka, Lulu, Yuna. I guess I'll get them involved. Why not, right? Uh, a little quick hit. There we are. If it comes to it, I might quickly uh, do a summon with Yuna. 
Maybe I'll go with the Maga Sisters, because they're insanely powerful. I wonder if we can slow them down. That, I do not know. I'm going to try that. But yeah, double cast Ultima with Lulu and Yuna, of course. And uh, let the MP flow. Let the HP, you know, flow. Well, you want to keep an eye on your HP, but... Uh, First and foremost, man, it's about dealing out the attacks to Sin here. You want to make sure you're damaging him well. And you can't go wrong with four nines, right? Especially twice in a row! Oh, I need someone with a sensor! How unfortunate. You know, do you have a sensor? No, you know, you have your super rod. The super rod! All right, so double casting. I don't think I have haste on everyone here. Who has sensor on? Riku? Oh man, we have broken the limit. Those are nice attacks. And I've barely gone into crazy level up mode. You know, I mean, you could, I mean, you could only imagine how much more you can improve. You can master the entire sphere grid, of course. So imagine doing that and then taking on Sin. <laughs> Sin would be nothing. That's, uh, that's where those mega bosses come in. Oh man, we're still learning overdrive modes at the end. It's so funny, isn't it funny? Are we in range of Sin yet? I don't know. Guess I'll just, uh... There we are. I mean, I really don't even have to get everyone involved in the battles. At this point, it doesn't matter much. Woof! <laughs> A couple more of those beauties. I have drawn this in. I think we are now, yeah, we're in range now. I could attack with anybody and everybody. Observe. Well done, Kamari. Uh, I'm gonna use I'm gonna use Yuna now. Yeah, okay. Ah, oh, really? You can do that, man. Auto heal that auto stuff. That just helps out. Man, you can do the zombie attacks. That's funny though. All right. Well, I'm just gonna get everyone else involved. I got Riku involved. I can't recall if I got Waka involved, actually. I'll use Orn and Waka a little bit here, but, uh... Hmm. I'm gonna do Armor Break. I think we can get Armor Break on him here. Yeah, good stuff. Armor Break is a good idea, probably. Waka. Why don't we try Triple Foul and see what we can do. Buka! Pretty good attack. All right. Uh, so is that everyone? I think right now I'm just going to be double casting Ultima for pretty much the remainder of the battle, folks. Uh, if you don't know Ultima, learn Ultima. And if you refuse, then I guess use Flare. Flare and your Aeons. I'm thinking I'm not going to really need to use my Aeons here. I don't think it's going to be a, a requirement for me here. His gauge is going up little by little. But still, I mean, I, uh, yeah, I'm going to be just fine. Have I really gotten everyone involved? Might as well try and charge up your uh, gauge, Titus. Yeah, there you go. Buka! And that's Sin!
Yeah, you guessed it, folks. Seymour is among us. Uh, I'm not too sure how that really uh, worked. I don't know. We were drawn into his eyeball. But you could hear him, man. You could hear him. His presence is around us. And uh, something tells me we're going to be having an encounter with him at some point in the future. Sooner rather than later. Anyway, we reap the rewards from the battle. And uh, yeah, man, if you just master a couple of people's uh, sphere grids... Uh, you know, just the character path, uh, and then learn some Ultima, you can pretty much defeat Sin pretty, pretty simply. It's not that hard. Good stuff. <laughs> oh, there you go. Dan, where are you? We must go to him. Then we will. Let me take front. Good luck. Follow me. Titus, no one's following you. Let me take front. Follow me! Let me take front, please! Can I lead? Please, can I lead? They're all ahead of him. I just, I find it really funny. Uh, yeah, we can board the airship from here. It's kind of funny. The airship's behind us, so naturally you kind of turn around. All right, so I just, you know, I kind of want to do a little more purchasing from Rin. Uh, yeah, I just want to get a couple items. Uh, where's the... Where's the, where's the ladder? Where's the door? I need to, urgh, I can't get in. It's kind of funny and silly in a way. I guess I think back to Final Fantasy VII, you know? You want to climb up that ladder? Or, isn't that what we did? Yeah. But here you interact with the save sphere and then you board the airship from here. Everyone's here. <laughs> Good stuff. And, uh, talk to Sid. We're counting on you, kid. This is pretty much it, though, folks. There is uh, really no point in return if we continue on. So if you want to do anything, if you want to level up, if you want to visit any location, if you want to do side quests, any kind of side quest, or the crazy stuff, like the Dark Aeons and the boss battles and this and that, if you want to do anything, do it now, because this is pretty much the point of no return. No going back now, man. No matter what happens, I'll see this through to the end. I promise. We've been through a lot, yeah? And hey, we're not finished yet! You've proven yourself as a guardian. Maybe even as the best. Sometimes, when I got a lot on my mind, it just helps to go... Ah! soon, we're almost done. You know, your meeting Yuna was really quite. Our spirits rooting for us. Let's not let them down, yeah? Oh, Riku, please don't scream again, please. Once the calm starts, we'll take the airship to your Xanarkand. Never better. You know, I am too. No matter what happens, I'll see this through to the end. I promise. We're almost done. How are you doing? Yeah, we have the option here. I wanted to get back here. To answer Yuna. I can't say any of the bad ones. I just can't do it. You know, I am too. But I think that's all everyone says to me here. And to think, you hadn't come floating out of the sea that day. Can't say praise be to Yevon anymore, can we? 
just a feeling, but I think my dad kind of likes you. Sometimes, when I got a lot on my mind, it just helps to go... There it is. Okay, thanks for that. So that's pretty much a wrap. Uh, that's all, all That's all, all these characters will say. And, uh, yeah, I can't reply to Yuna by just saying so-so or not good, man, because I'm feeling great! I'd like to meet Jekt before he fades away. When this is over, I will leave. I have played at life too long. Ten years ago, I honored Jekt's last words and traveled to Zanarkin. I plan to stay there watching over you. But when Sin attacked Xanarkand that day, I changed my mind. Outside the dream world, life can be harsh, even cruel. But it is life. He wanted you to have a shot at life. I saw it in Sin's eyes. That's why I brought you here, to Spira. I'd like to meet Jekt before he fades away. Ronso was singing too. Kimari's ears never wrong. Kimari felt friendship from somewhere inside Sin. There is no need for fear. Kimari will go with you. May I help you? So yeah, like I said, folks, do any weapon purchasing or you know, equipment purchasing or item purchasing that you can do now because this really, this is it. Thank you. Your patronage is very much appreciated. Out of all those characters, I think it's pretty interesting talking to Orin there. He was uh, really going back to the beginning of of uh, all that has happened. And he was talking about how, uh, you know, he brought Titus to Spira and this and that. I don't know, it's just kind of cool. A little tidbit from the uh, past, recent past. Sin still sits. It moves not. It seems to wait for us. If only the main gun worked, we could shoot Sin down. Yeah, there's no action up on the deck. So yeah, folks, when you're totally ready and prepared, it's go time. And, uh... And yeah, I suppose I could do a couple more moves around the old sphere grid, but I think I'm going to do that uh, off the clock. No point in doing that now. Other than that, I think I'm prepared. I've been everywhere in the airship, and there's no one else to talk to and no other place to explore. So, folks, I think that's it for me, and I'm going to call it a wrap right here. Good stuff. On our next part, I'm going to begin down below, and we're going to take it from there. Our next destination is Inside Sin. Good stuff, folks. Calling it a wrap right here, though. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Quiz me in those comments and tell me what you think. I'm Dave the Usher for the Game Replay. Stay tuned for the next part of Final Fantasy X HD Remaster. I will see you guys next time. I am out.